I've been asked many times by people about the advanced soft tissue technique course. So I thought I would just do a short video just explaining what exactly is covered. So if you read the first text here, it basically says it's got 22 modules of over 120 individual lessons. So if I just slowly start scrolling down, so obviously most courses will have an introduction. Thank you for booking. There's a video there to say thank you and what to do, etc. There's a short video on how to navigate the course, how to go through it. There's a little bit about myself, the outline of objectives, uh, and then the introduction to why I designed the course. And then this sort of comes into the lesson one, um, which is an introduction to soft tissue. So I tapped on one of these. So then you can see here that the first, it says six seconds, this doesn't do anything, it just allows you to click onto the next lesson. So when you see the six seconds, that's not nothing. So if you clicked on, say, the second one, this is a, I'm not sure how long this is, this is a, almost a 10 minute video, and I explain some of the soft tissue techniques on a model. So if I just play this now, you need too much application onto the body's tissues. So we're going to run through some techniques here. Okay, so um, what we can do first of all is the patient is going to be, but I can, even though the patient might not perceive more pressure with the movement. So I explained a few variations during that video about how to like utilize METs uh, using your fingers, using the active techniques, using passive techniques, using forearms, etc., etc. And then once you've done the first lesson, then you'll have to do an assessment. And on this one, it'll be 11 questions for you to answer. And it's 100% pass mark. And if you do happen to fail, then you can check the results. And once you've done that category, it basically unlocks to the next one. So then the next one will be muscle imbalances of the postural and phasic muscles. And then if I press this, um, there is a video to the antagonistic muscles. So this is the video explaining the PDF. So each section has PDFs, uh, but you can actually download. And if I go, say, to the first lesson uh, on muscle imbalance, which is the first one of lesson two, then you can see here there is a soft tissue technique lesson that you can download. Uh, and that's the same for all of them. So I go back to the beginning and click on, say, lesson one. That is a soft tissue techniques lesson one along here. Let's move through. So that's the introduction to soft tissue. The second one is imbalances, postural and phasic muscles. The third one is myofascial slings and core muscle relationships. And again, you've got PowerPoint presentations on these ones. And then it goes into the nitty gritty of METs, which I wrote a book on. So you will get my book as a sort of PDF or part of it as, a, as PDF chapters, which you can download. And then again, you can see lesson four assessment positional release and strain counter strain techniques so then you can have a look at these uh, along here so i'll show a few variations uh, the problem is now if i clicked on one i'd have to do the assessment for each if i clicked on it probably said the post is locked along here so you have to pass the lesson say four to allow lesson five to open so there's some practical applications on upper limb and lower limb for that one then it's all about the cervical spine so areas like levator scap, trapezius, and then assessment four. And then we're looking at other sort of areas, as in like lesson seven, which would be more for sternocleidomastoid and scalenes. And you can see it has a process, anatomy of the SCM, and scalene, MET assessment, MET treatment. And also I've got the first rib in there as well. Then the shoulder. Shoulder one's pretty complex. There's a lot of theory related to this one. And then all different techniques or the infraspinatus, subscap, supraspinatus is in there somewhere. Uh, maybe you can have a look at that. Different positions as well, sideline, prone, yeah, and then also some for sitting. Then the pectoral muscles along here, pectoralis major and minor. And then we're on to the next section, which will be for the lats. So whole section just on the latissimus dorsi. Teres major will be included in that one. Then we look at the thoracic spine, anatomy of the spine, and then the muscles related to that as well along here. So we do like rhomboids, mid traps, serratus anterior, 
forearm muscles. So then we, we cover the forearm. And then from there, we then go down towards the lower back. So the anatomy of a lumbar spine, the treatment of the, well, the assessment and treatment of the erector spinal muscles. And then we focus a bit more on the lower back as in the quadratus lumborum. So we go through the whole sort of treatment processes here. Moving on to the hip and groin region. So I call it the hip complex because I'll be writing a book at some point. Uh, a few little bit of bits about the pelvis, like pelvic rotation here. But about uh, soft tissue release for the piriformis. The iliopsoas, which is iliacus and psoas, and the rectus femoris. So assessment, treatments, anatomy, all this, different testing, like the Ely test here, the psoas, uh, the modified Thomas test is another one. TFL and IT band, the theory of, again, and then the treatment, the hamstrings as a group, and then we can specify between the bicep femoris and the two semis. And then moving on to the adductors, okay, so the hip adductors, which is like the pectineus, pelvis magnus longus, and a bit of the gracilis. The last section, so this is more for the lower limb. So we're looking at the gastrocnemius, okay, as in the calf muscles and the Achilles tendon. Also the soleus and the peroneals we will cover. The last couple of sections will be on anterior shin, medial shin, you know, like tibialis posterior, yeah, you know, muscles like that. And then a little bit on the foot and ankle complex. So uh, we'll be doing a lot of the muscles around there. And then extra resources, articles, and then wrapping things up. And then other courses are here. So pretty full on. So it'll be 22 assessments, yeah, over 120 individual lessons. Uh, once you've done it, you will then be able to print off your certificate. Um, I think it's over, I think it's maybe 50 to 60 hours CPD for this one because it's pretty full on. Yeah. Um, so, um, so there you go. And then once you've done this, this one counts towards the diploma. And currently the diploma is 10 modules. Okay, so this will be one of 10. But once you've done the 10th one, then you can go onto my website as a registered body master method practitioner. Uh, and then you can do the courses if you decide to in the future for the half price. I hope you enjoyed the short presentation on the advanced soft tissue technique online.